this is called folding your laundry in the laundry room. So I just took the shit out of the, um, the dryer. I left it in there overnight. Um, I just, I only wash like once a week. I don't really separate cup length. Sometimes I separate colors, whites and mediums, but for the most part I don't. Um, I'm wearing this today. So this is why I washed it. I like to layer. So I just put it on over. If you buy shit from places like Uniqlo, um, you don't need to buy it like hella times. You can buy it once. So like this is like a Uniqlo uh, shirt. It's a shirt I use for bartending. So what I'm gonna do is go inside to my apartment and put it on the hanger. Um, and then as you guys see, I wash panties. So I just separate out the panties um, here. Got these, that's a nice pair. We got socks. I like to pair the socks so we don't get lost. Um, I actually had this sock on last night. Um, so we've got more pants here. I usually, typically I wash my pants like once a month. Um, I don't wash them like every week. Like once a month is enough. Um, yeah, so just folding them up. Uh, this is another shirt. We're gonna have to put it on a hanger. Right now, it's inside out. It's okay. Um, these are just like nighttime thermal shirts. So this is all sleepwear, thermal. So you just want to take the. Um, the arms like that, and put it in. Okay. This is sleepwear. It's inside out right now, but it, it doesn't matter because like whenever I pull it out to go to sleep, I'll just turn it right side in. This is another one of our unique little rib cage shirts. Um, that one goes in the hanger. Okay. Um, these are my Carhartt sleepwear um, thermals. As you can see, they've gotten a lot of wear. I've had these for like 12 years. Um, so yeah, we just stack the sleepwear on top of each other. Um, so this is one of the Gap uh, True Fit. No, this is actually Eddie Bauer. But that's a hanger shirt too. So the deal with the rib cage shirts is if you're going on casting calls and uh, the agents wanna see your body type, you want to wear a rib cage shirt so that they can like see your ribs. That's like the whole point. So this is just, oh yeah, this is my American Idiot t-shirt from the Game Day concert. One of my favorites. I hang this one up too. Uh, we got some panties here. Another rib cage shirt. That goes on a hanger. Period panties. Sports bra. Um, I don't know what shirt this is. Oh, this is like a sweater. Um, I guess I got a bleach thing, that's all right. Um, oh wow, it's got a whole bleach, it, it got bleached. That's all right. And then we've got some socks. If we can't find, uh, that's another, oh, wow, see that? That one got bleached too. Um, hmm. I'm not sure about this one. I think I might have to. Oh, somebody put their socks in with mine. That's not what I thought. This one's mine. All right. So let's take all this shit in. We will store it when we get into my apartment. These are some workout clothes. Those panties that I told you guys about. I'm going to separate these inside. Oh, this is another Henley. dead it's kind of like yeah i mean it got bleached i think we're gonna have to move on from the bleached shit like yeah shit with bleach stains i don't think we can we can do it at this point we're grown-ups guys <laughs> 